this wet spring means a whole lot of weeds. Angela Schilling is live in Eastern with a closer look at the wet spring and all the weeds that are popping up behind you and all over town. It's beautiful and green, but that could pose a problem later, right, Angela? Yeah, it uh, definitely could. And, you know, this year, though, it's not so much, you know, about uh, the height of the weeds. I mean, look behind me, you can see it is kind of possible, but the main story for it this year, after talking to the experts, is more so about the amount of weeds. Now's the time to pick weeds, and this year there's lots of them. If it grows, it's growing this year, and of course the big one's the foxtail. It's coming in thick, too. The big deal is anything that is growing is growing heavy. Some seeds are germinating for the first time in decades. Cheat grass, um, wild oats, if you will, uh, different plants, but basically people recognize them as the same, um, are just going nuts right now. You can thank our wet spring for all the lush green vegetation. It's actually the third wettest spring on record. We got well over an inch and a half of rain in May alone. Average is about a half inch. Places that have generally stayed pretty weed free and have had good abatement programs over the years, well, the weeds are growing. And they still are. There's typically a lag time between when it rains and the weed grows. It's called perking. It's the amount of time it takes the water to get off the surface and actually go down through all of our great Nevada clay and Nevada sand and everything. But it does take time. The worst thing you can do is wait to pick them. While they're green, it's the perfect time. One thing you don't want to do is let the weeds get a ahead of you. Once the weeds get ahead of you, you've got a problem. They're easier to pick now, too. Once the ground gets dry, they're not going to want to come out of the ground. And by then, the weeds are ready to burn as well. Weeds grow in mild temperatures when it's not too hot or too cold. Once we really start to heat up, all the weeds become fuel and dry out. For now, though, the theme is green, and lawn care owners are staying busy. Now, Joe did mention that he's also been pulling weeds for customers ever since January. Covering the story live, Angela Schilling, Channel 2 News.